Story Time at Home, presented by the Cincinnati and Hamilton County Public Library. Hello, my name is Mr. Kelwin, and I work at the Grosbeck Branch Library. I am father to Jeremiah Hester. He is now a 20-year-old. When he was little, I used to read books to him like this one. Lion Needs a Haircut. You need a haircut. No, I don't. Yes, you do. Don't worry. Barber Goat will take good care of you. His scissors won't cut your ears. I know. I'm not worried. I just don't want to get a haircut. Oh. I understand why you don't want to, but there's nothing to be scared of. Are you afraid of razors? I'm not scared. I'm a lion. Arr. I see, I see. You're thinking you look like an antelope. You'll just get a little trim. No antelope hair for you. Ouch! What are you talking about? I don't want a haircut at all. I look just fine. You are getting a haircut. You look grubby. Your mane is wild and it's extremely hard to brush your hair. No! Roar! Yes! Roar! I just wanted my hair to look like yours. Oh, you did? I thought you were scared. I used to be scared of scissors, razors, and blow dryers when I was a kid. I know I look amazing, but you will be as handsome as me after you get a little trim. Stop kissing me. It's prickly. You need a haircut. Me? No, I don't need a haircut. Yes, you do. Are you scared? No, why? I've been to the barber shop a million times. Oh, no problem then. We can go to the barber shop together. Mama said you need a haircut too. She did? Yes, your hair is wild and unruly. And she doesn't like how you always have mustard on your mustache and breadcrumbs in your beard. See, if you get a haircut, I will. But, but I look just fine. Short hair doesn't look good on me. Alrighty, no haircut for either of us. Sounds fair to me. Wait. <laughs> I'll get a haircut, but absolutely no antelope hair, just a little trim, okay? Are you sure? Since you've been to the barber shop a million times, you go first. You look great, kiddo. You too. See, there was nothing to be worried about. I wasn't worried. Yes, you were, but it's okay. I won't tell anyone. The end. I hope you've enjoyed this story. Happy Father's Day to all those fathers out there. Thank you for joining us. Have a great day, bye. Got free books in the mail. Sign 
coming up today. Go to Ohio Imagination Library. Org to find out more.